In a primetime news follow-up now, the police say things have normalized in Denham Town in the Kingston Western Police Division following a fierce shootout between them and gunmen yesterday. Here is Kirk Wright with the latest. The police say one of their own was injured following Tuesday's incident, but it's not gunshot related. That policeman has since been treated and released. They say a gun was also seized, but they're trying to find the criminals involved in the shootout. TVJ News understands that the police who were involved in the gun battle were on Bentley Lane in the Maxfield area. It's where a 21-year-old identified as Howard Barton was shot and killed. A little of what we know about the individual, he was identified as someone who was listed recently as a person of interest in the shooting death of a 16-year-old girl in Trenchtown. So they have identified him so far and they are still making some more checks on, on the, in that particular case. It's while the police team were on that scene that they heard explosions in the College Smith area and responded. The police say gunmen then fired at them and they fired back. The shootout lasted for more than half an hour. The men um, escaped by go, going into the Maypen Cemetery and something that I just want to provide a little more clarity on that we saw some video last night that gave the impression that it was the Denham Town station per se that was attacked by, by criminals. But in, the, in this case, the, um, the, the shooting happened within the vicinity of the police station, but it was the police officers that responded to the explosions, explosions heard in the area that were being fired on and not the station. Kirk Wright, TVJ News.